France, 1628. The Catholic King Louis XIII has it in for the Protestant city of La Rochelle, which is causing up to his English enemies and defying his authority. He demands their loyalty, but the town has the cheek to refuse. Louis's councillor, Cardinal Richelieu, organized a siege, but La Rochelle refused to cave. The city had good thick walls and a port to bring in supplies from its English friends. Hoping to starve the city into submission, the Cardinal brought in over 20,000 soldiers and built a giant seawall to block off the harbor. The siege began in September 1627. The blockade really began to bite in May. Beggars were run out of town, only to be shot by the soldiers waiting outside. Those who remained ate horses, cats, dogs, rats, and even slugs. They boiled a parchment and leather boots and hearts with sugar to make jelly. By September, half the soldiers who took up their posts in the morning were dead by evening. One poor woman's head and arms became lunch for the ladies next door. La Rochelle surrendered on 28 October 1628. 80% of its population, some 20,000 people, had starved to death. The king entered the city, attended mass, and went straight back to Paris, generously pardoning the 5,500 survivors. We'll be back soon with more edifying examples of creative cruelty.